rough side drag and it is smoothing out so uh it will work itself out sooner or later i don't know it could be a lightning strike could be whatever i mean i don't know things work out hey billy bob i can tolerate it until it's no longer there take care deer slayer either way hey deer slayer tell that knucklehead get out of the way Hey, Deer Slayer, tell that knucklehead to get out of the way. Huh? Tell that knucklehead to get out of the way. Night 45, you said tell Billy Bob you said a big high five, and uh, yeah, you got no problem getting over it either, man. Have a good day. I'll get back out of the way, Deer Slayer Sam Piles. Hey, Deer Slayer, 445 Mississippi says, tell them knuckleheads to get out of the way, Javon. Hey, Deer Slayer, tell them knuckleheads to get out of the way, Javon. Hey, Billy Bob, that's a good deal. That's a good deal. Y'all can talk 90 miles away when the banjo's 10 miles from you. Oh, heck yeah. Wasting his time for the most part, but uh, it'll work itself out. Take care. I'm back out of the way. Hello down there, Deer Slayer. Hey, Monday morning way, 44.5 Mississippi. And four. Yeah, who was that waving at me? 44-5 Mississippi. Good mo a Monday morning wave. Man, that was a mess. I heard 101. I heard White Cloud. Good morning to you two guys. Big Father's Day wave, and I think that was you, 445. Good morning to you. Yeah, that was me. That was old Slick Rick. Hey, uh, Deer Slayer. Monday morning wave from Deer from uh, Slick Rick in Mississippi. Right, your slick Rick. Well, I had to turn over towards you, man, because I uh, pointed up a little farther north. It was kind of crowded, but I still heard you. But now it's all about you, 10-4. <laughs> 10-4, I was just trying to tell you to pass a five to Billy Bob and uh, and uh, and White Cloud. Tell them uh, slick Rick waved at him. Right, your slick Rick, 445. Well, uh. Hey, Billy Bob and White Cloud, 0445, I guess y'all don't have conditions to each other this morning. I don't know. He's, he's saying the big old morning wave up your way there, Roger. Roger, for, uh, Billy Bob said a big high five back to you, uh, Slick Rick. Yeah, well, ten four. I appreciate it. Hey, uh, sounding good down there on the sand pile this morning. I'm just sitting back here reading the mail, ten four. Right, you're four. Well, yeah, that's what I was doing, but uh, I started keying up and talking, and kind of got stuck in here. Came in. I just got done mowing a bit ago, so I came in here to cool off and see what was going on. And boy, it's still noisy, just like it was when I turned it off at 8:30 last night. There, Roger. Yeah, I turned mine off about 10.30 up here. About 10.30 when I, I did the last gate there, Tempo. Wow, was it still coming in like that, like it was a few hours before that? Yeah, Paul. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> I could have stayed up another hour or more, Tempo. Now, that's crazy. Well, that's good, man. Uh, I'm glad this cycle's in there because we went for a while where you'd go several weeks, sometimes months, without any kind of decent conditions. So uh, it's nice having this cycle in there, Roger. Well, aggravate me. Oh, no doubt about it. All right, there you go, Deerslayer. I heard 18 down there. 
I'm gonna get out of the way. I'm on the Hoggy Channel, 445 Slick Rick, Mississippi. I'll see y'all later. Bye bye bye. All right, 445. Have a great day, buddy. We'll catch you, bro. Sounding real good over here too. Hey, Slick Rick, take care. Father's Day wave when it gets here. Deer Slayer, Lake Okeechobee. Hello, 445. Hey, 445. Your friend 109. Yeah, who is that waving? Hello, 109. Hey, Deer Slayer, keyed up. Hey, uh, 109. 445. Monday morning wave. Hi there, 145. Yeah, I'm coming back to him, and he dusts my britches there pretty good, so I guess I'll get out of here. Just one wave hand, and let you let you know you sound again. 445. Out there, 109. Well, at least your britches stay clean. Hey, uh, 109. At least your britches stay clean. Tip all. Top of the day to you, Deer Slayer. Morning, Deer Slayer. If we get through all that traffic out there. Oh yeah. Out there, 109. We'll see you in a couple weeks. Take care down there, buddy. Bye bye bye. All right, well, Delby, we shake your hand again. Been a while since we put the spoke and the handshake on you. You haven't been there in a couple of years there, so we're looking forward to seeing you again. Catch you later, 445, you're 109, stepping. Damn poor, I heard it all. I got the gate rolling. Have a good one. Bye, bye, bye. Again, I wasn't looking up your way, and you still got my radio. 77 Bluegrass, Monday morning wave, Deer Slayer wave. Sure coming back to you, Damn. You guys got some good sound rigs out there. K5, Central Florida, just playing. Hey, good morning. Uh, Monday morning wave. King Fox. Hey, King Fox. Slick Rick, Mississippi, waving. Got all that done, man. Mm -hmm. So I'm good to go for another week there, right? Mm -hmm. Flush time out here in another hour. Another hour, it's going to be flush time. Dog on the time to fly. Hop on. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'll be up there in the fall. All right, buddy. Yeah, we'll work that out. Sure will. I got to try to take my antenna down. Happy, happy day. And I hope that won't take more than a day or two, and I can get it back up. But I got to do some work on that antenna there. Ten four. I don't think it really matters. I mean, I've talked to guys that are five feet off the ground, nine feet off the ground. Some of them are way up there, 60, 70, 80 feet. I really don't think it much matters for uh, for DX. I mean, for local talking, you know, that, that old saying, height is might, so uh, the higher the better. But for, local, for uh, DX talking, man, you look at most of these ham radio guys, their antennas are Usually about right around the fir first wavelength, uh, you know, in the in the 30s, 30 something feet off the ground. Mine's only 45, but uh, I don't think it really matters. Uh, be honest with you, there, Roger. Maybe so. Hell, we might get out. All right, 77. Yeah, I'm, so I'm in the first wavelength. You're up in the second wavelength. It doesn't matter. I mean, I really don't think it matters. I mean, hell, I've talked, Skip, when I was building antennas out here, I had them sitting on sawhorses on the ground, 30 inches off the ground, talking Skip on them. So uh, I really don't think it matters that much. But, uh, I mean, if you're comfortable with them being way up there, that's fine. I'm not. This one's at 45. My one in Kentucky is about the same, about 45 feet. So uh, that's where I feel comfortable having it, to be honest with you. Go any higher, I start worrying about something happening. So take care. Have a good day up there, buddy. We'll catch you next time. 77 Bluegrass, Deer Slayer, Sam Piles.
hear Zeppelin. I hear Zeppelin. Yeah, 102, around North Carolina. Deer Slayer, Sam Piles waving. Yeah, I had to turn this antenna a little bit, but I got you all up in there. Hey, 102, be ready to wave to you. Yeah, up around the hall guard, high pockets, down around the pile, we are looking your way. And I hope you, your week is starting out good, and uh, have a safe one, and a great big Father's Day when it gets here. Hey, 102 in the Carolinas, take care, I appreciate the shout. Deer Slayer, Lake Okeechobee. somebody waving, man, but my needle stuck up on 20 dB, so uh, I don't know if I'm pointed at you or not, but good morning. We got a room full of you down here on the same file as old King 5 at the Kennedy Space Center. How you doing today, man? 